So hello everyone, welcome back. Today we've got part number eight of the two pound coin hunt series we are doing. Uh, 500 pounds in two pound coins. Uh, let's show you what we need for the album. We're gonna do the album before we open now. <laughs> we need all four Commonwealth games. I've never found one. They'd be amazing. We need Olympic handover Beijing, Olympic handover Rio, Olympic centenary, Golden Guinea, uh, Underground Roundel. Uh, we've got two spaces for the um, partial and full flag error on the Navy centenary and 2015 Britannia, and that is it. So the Commonwealths are gonna be the ones that are gonna be the, uh, the tricky ones. So let's get into it. And I wonder, could today be the day? Let's zoom in slightly. So let's show you what we're looking for. Well, that is a 2016 I saw, Britannia. Very nice, one of my favorite two pound coin designs. Obviously 2015 is the one you want to find with those, but 2016 is still very, very nice. So that one is technologies. Uh, we don't want those, you've probably seen those before. They're all common. Some people keep certain years, no one I know actually, but uh, some of the years are lower minted. But I don't keep any of them, and anything that doesn't look like that is a good find. But nothing else in the first bag. So I, I said it last time, and I'll say it again. The, uh, the objective is either NIFC, Territory, or Commonwealth. And there's a shiny one there. That is Shakespeare's Histories. Uh, which says the hollow crown on the edge. Nothing else there. So yeah, um, a Jersey, a Guernsey, Isle of Man, any one of those would be amazing to find a two pound coin. It's a shiny 2015. Some people have been finding, including myself, the uh, rotation errors on those coins. There's Guy Fawkes, very nice, but a common one. Is that something? Just uh, very dirty. Oh, Bruno's Arches, another common one. Oh, there we go. Well, there's two there. Let's deal with this one first. The Hollow Crown, um, once again, um, that way up. <laughs> Shakespeare's histories, but more importantly, we have got a Navy Centenary. Again, these are 650,000 vintage, but I find so many of them. And obviously this one does not have the flag error, which is on the uh, mast there. But uh, yeah, I've never found a full flag error. I found a partial one, but never a full flag error. Also, let me know how much you want me to zoom in, because I'm trying to, trying to work it out so that it's not ridiculously close, but so that it's kind of not too far away either. Let me know what you think. But a Navy Centenary is always nice. There is Robert Burns, which is another one that's slightly more than face value. But I think we already have that one for the book. No way. And that's a full flag error. Is it a full flag error? Look at that. Navy Centenary, full flag error. Unbelievable. Amazing stuff. Let's try and point with the pair of scissors. You can see just there, 
there's a bit of extra metal and it kind of looks like a flag. I mean, I think it must have been in the design, surely, because it's too coincidental for there to be a flag. Let's just have a closer look off camera myself. I don't know, but that is a full flag error. Unbelievable, and that will go in the book as well. Huh. Oh my! <laughs> there's, there's so much in here. There's, oh my days. Right, another histories. Please be a 2015. Oh, it's 2016. <laughs> 2016, but there is an underground roundel. I've never found one of these before. And it's one for the book, so we're ticking off. Well, two if you include the, the navy, because uh, obviously it's under my error. I mean, that. Is... Again, the hunt is complete. The hunt is complete already. I can't believe I found a full flag error. I think that looks like it's one of the new ones that have been released as well. There is a VE Day Anniversary, St Paul's Cathedral. Nothing else there. There is Act of Union, common one. There's another Shakespeare's Histories. We do find a fair few of those now. That's an error, surely. Well, yeah, that's definitely a slight rotation error. The dot there should be at the bottom. Well, that is... Uh, maybe, maybe not. I won't keep it because that's a bit... It's kind of like uh, the most small margin of error there, but... The one I found before was about 45 degrees, so we won't keep that one. There is another active union. Looks a bit, uh, a bit beaten up. Well, that's a shame. There's another Shakespeare's histories. Oh, and Bruno's portrait. Another Bruno's Arches, had a little bit of a dry dry spell there. Not that I'm complaining after finding a full flag error. And there's the Shakespeare's Tragedies. 
And the edge inscription, what a piece of work is a man. That's the non-error, the normal one. No commonwealths. <laughs> There is 1807 um, with the textured finish, so that's the uh, the common circulating one. Very shiny Shakespeare's histories. Another 1807, another common one. Another shiny one, another Shakespeare's histories. A huge, large pile of those now. Oh, another Britannia. This looks too shiny to be a 2015. Yep, another 2016. But still, three Britannias is pretty good, to be fair. Lovely design oh, and wireless transmission. One of my favourite £2 designs. Brunel's portrait there. And this is the last bag. We've whizzed through these. Yeah, um, not a bad hunt, not bad as far as two pounds go. There's another VE day anniversary, but nothing else. So let's go and get the new ones into the book.
So we've got those two in the book. Uh, Roundel is at the top there, and the full flag error is in the book there. What a find that is. Well, yeah, I mean, if you've enjoyed, make sure to leave a like. Uh, we still need the Commonwealths and a couple on that page. But we are making steady, steady, steady progress. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more coins to go. But yeah, if you've enjoyed, make sure to leave a like down below, comment, subscribe, and I shall see you later. Bye for now.